Can I beat Kingdom Rush Frontiers with just saxophone? Can I beat it with just barracks? Let's find out. Level one, ah, it's pretty easy as you expect. You have to know that there's a little, uh, there's a little help for some extra towers in this game that you can't avoid. You can't just like delete all those, you know, substitute archers that are floating around here and there. The bullet guys in the later levels with the friggin' you know what. Look at that. I'm busy talking and we frickin' are just on a third level, fourth level. I don't know. Finally, we have the assassins. I never really used these guys that much until I got into this challenge. But they, I think they can insta kill, right? That's the thing. You know the thing. If I'm wrong, just you know destroy me in the comments that'd be fine look at these bees though these bees are going to be the death of me i didn't think this challenge would be possible maybe it is maybe it isn't you're gonna have to stay until the end to watch the whole freaking thing you lazy instant gratification seeking Ugh, i don't know what oh anyways i'm onto this level there's no wasps they're not bees okay but you know you know the thing Come on, just give me a freaking break. It's my first day. Actually, it's not. So this level doesn't have any bees, so I just wipe through it. Doesn't matter, I have my assassins. I can take out everything. This level does have giant wasps, and it has the gianter wasps, as you'll see. And I got all these freaking summoning summoners to the right, sometimes to the left, that are trying to summon mummies, and I'm like, okay, let's, let's get it together now. But I make it through. Not bad. I gotta take down this genie that keeps snapping away all my freaking warriors. So most of the work is going to Boneheart. But I think they do sneak in some stuff here and there. But anyways, with some patience, he goes down. Back into the lamp for another eternity. Now on to the Mega Wasp Death Levels. I recorded this level so much, I wanted to give up. I wanted to never play this game again. But finally, I figured out somehow Dante was the best person for this level. He just shot just quick enough to take out the wasps. I have a measly four hearts, but after, I don't know, at least 10 tries on this long, boring level, I'm very happy with that. I thought that that level was gonna be the end of this challenge, but I made it through. This level's been a little greasy here and there, but Dante pulls through for me again. I finished it with one heart. Now, this level straight from the depths of heck how the heck could this level even be possible it's so long to even get to this point too it's not like i can just save state a million times and then you know start it wave whatever wave i keep dying i think it's like 13 14 15 you know somewhere in there i think i made it to 14 or 15 on this this attempt right here and then finally I figured out the strategy. Do you want to know what the strategy is? Boneheart can only shoot out his green, you know, things that travel through the level if there's someone on the ground. He can't shoot it at flying foes. And it takes out those purple nurples. The freaking parasites, it takes them out. So basically, he'll shoot it out, I think it's like every 20 seconds. So you need to just camp him in the back, move him around a little bit, and make sure he shoots out the green stuff perfectly. <laughs> And he does it basically every time those purple nurples show up. He kills the parasites. Look at this. Hmm, well, I was supposed to edit that part out, but I did it! I freaking did it! Yes! Now into this level. There's some more giant wasps, but I'm using my technique of, you know, the dragon targeting the ground folks and then shooting out his green laser beams, and it's working. I feel like this level will be possible. I do have these birds that are really fast when you knock their freaking spear throwing riders off them but you know so far they haven't been insane but i'm down to four hearts i'm on the last wave i'm thinking i'm gonna be okay i do have a lot of poison freaking you know those guys to deal with they're incredibly annoying you have to move around your freaking soldiers a lot okay just get used to it if you want to just park everything that's not gonna work you'll never make it through this challenge so I beat it with one star. Now I'm onto this dreaded level. Every wave is easy up until wave 15. The monkeys just, they get through, man. They're there. Look at them. How can I deal with this? Like, am I choosing the wrong tower? Should I have done all assassins and not the, you know, knights of the round table, whatever the heck they're called, those guys that are from 
the end of that Indiana Jones movie? I don't know. Basically, how I figured it out was I needed to spread out my guys and stall a little bit more. That was it. Just, just spread them out. Upgrade toward the rear and you'll do fine. So this boss is taking me a very long time. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's insane. I'm basically taking him down with just meteors and reinforcements at this point. My guys can't really hit him hardly at all. He makes it so close to the exit. And finally I take him down! Woo! So I made it through all those levels. Now I'm into the caves. The Donkey Kong caves. With the mine carts. Actually, that's in Kingdom Rush Vengeance. But this level, I didn't think that there was any chance I was going to lose. Because I have Boneheart shooting on his green laser beams of death. And you just upgrade everything. And there we go. Now this dreaded level. I played this level probably 15 times. I couldn't figure out how to defeat those frickin' dragons. And I finally figured out that if I just time it just right, maybe get some lucky meteors, I can take out enough of them that they won't end me on wave 12 or whatever it is. And it worked. Frickin' it probably was 15 times. It was exhausting, but I did it just for you because I love you. The rest of this level isn't insane. Well, maybe it is a little insane. You do have to rely on the insta-kills from the assassins. I'm not going to lie. You have to have a little bit of luck. You have to rely on... I don't even know. Can somebody tell me in the comments what's the percentage on each sneak attack or whatever the assassins are doing that they'll insta-kill? One star. Made it through. Now this level. I thought this level was going to be easy. You already got some help. And I'm failing it left and right. There's dragons everywhere. There's an overwhelming amount of bad guys. And you just have a few puny soldiers to try to hit them with. You have to move around your guys a lot. You have to memorize every second of what's about to be thrown at you. Jeez, this freaking level. I never have had a problem with this level. That's how I know that this challenge is freaking insane. Okay, if you haven't realized so far, this is the hardest challenge I've ever done. Easily. I don't know if I'm going to get a challenge harder than this unless it's like can I beat the game with just telepathy? Then obviously I would fail that. This level is driving me insane. But I think this is the attempt where I get the farthest I can get. Also, there's a bit of a surprise coming up if, uh, <laughs> if you're getting bored. <laughs> I don't know how you could possibly get bored when I'm screaming at you. Anyways, every freaking second of this level is worth showing you. That's why I'm showing it all to you. You need to see how I keep losing. You need to see the enemies that I'm dealing with. Those frickin' champions whipping all of my soldiers. Area damage? I don't know. They're frickin' so strong, though. Ugh, why did I even try this challenge? This is just enraging. Wait a minute. I tricked you. <laughs> I beat that level. And now I just keep dying to the dragons. It's impossible. I'm calling it. Time to buy some bombs and nuke these mofos. I'm sick of losing like 20 times in a row. This level's impossible, man. So I throw up some frost wands, some nukes, and I take out those dragons. And this is the official failure. I'm not joking this time, okay? This level is impossible. There's too many flying enemies. There's no good hero to deal with it. I tried Broxa. I tried Dante. I tried Boneheart, who's the best anyways. And it is impossible. Verified impossible, okay? But I have the nukes, and I'm ready to fight the last boss. <laughs> I may be cheating, I may be feeling my own challenge, but I will kill you. I will win. I am fire, I am death. The plague has arrived indeed. Gosh, this guy is taking forever. This is on really fast speed, and geez, this boss took like, I think over 10 minutes. And he keeps destroying all of my upgrades. Uh, starting to piss me off. And I got him! Woohoo! <laughs> I did it! I cheated, but I did it! <laughs> so can you beat Kingdom Rush Frontiers with just barracks? No! It's impossible! You wanna fight me? It's impossible!